Well, welcome back to Vintage Farmhouse Antiques and Vintage and Antiques video presentation. We're going to show you this little Broadhurst side plate. We think this is from the River Scenes series of blue and white produced by them before 1994. So this is late 20th century. You can never be absolutely certain with English ironstone china because uh, there's no real definitive pattern record surviving. So... A lot of the designs on the scenes and series that they produced have been lost and there's very little. They never used a, a pattern reference EIT showing you the uh, standard Staffordshire underglaze printing English ironstone table work. Um, it's quite often abbreviated to EIT. This is ironstone china transfer printed. Beautiful cobalt blue ivy leaf and flowering borders in uh, lovely blue and white transfer where in the central scene really is a pastoral river scene with a semi-derelict house in the background fishermen going out on a boat in the, the foreground not from the castle series not one recognized from the dickens series absolutely nothing to give you a clue as to the series of this either on the transfer factory mark or the, the design but we think looking at the range available this is from the, the river scene series very nice condition plate just look at the glaze reflection on here this hasn't been used and for a vintage piece of ironstone of this uh, age you would expect some knife marks or damage on it and there's nothing on this it's, it's almost in mint condition very nice piece um, six and a half inch diameter side plate will be of interest to collectors of EIT and that is something that is becoming increasingly collectible because of the beautiful uh, series of transfer designs that they produced during the late 20th century. So there'll be a link in the description just below giving you the URL link directly through to the website listing for this piece of china. And it's got quite a few bits of EIT, not just in blue and white, red and white, brown and white, pink and white and green and white. Uh, they really were quite productive during the latter part of the 20th century. Thanks for watching.